everybody, Max here, aka Electric Playground, and welcome to my latest speed build in The Sims 2. This build is a shipping container house, and it is in this neighborhood that I am currently building. It is a sub hood, like kind of like Blue Water Village, and uh, I named it Belladonna City, and it's like I said, city, so it's more of an urban type of vibe. Um, I've been downloading a lot of uh, custom content neighborhood objects and I'm having a lot of fun building it so this is my area where I'm gonna be building uh, shipping container houses I'm thinking of making it like a little bit of a series on my channel and because uh, I really like them I, I love building them in The Sims and I absolutely love them in real life I look at pictures quite often of them because I would love to live in what live in one I think it'd be super awesome it's they're not super expensive either, so it'd be really cool to live in them in real life. I don't know if you've ever seen pictures of them, but if you haven't, type in like ship shipping containers on Google Images, and you'll see some really cool create like really cool ideas and really cool houses and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, um, this build uh, it has a uh, one room and a living room and bathroom and a kitchen. It's not open concept like some shipping container houses are. It's kind of closed off. Uh, the kitchen is cl and dining room are kind of in sh a shared room and then uh, the <clears throat> the living room and uh, the bathroom and the bedroom are in one of the containers. So uh, yeah, uh, I also did a really cute little backyard area and it's more of the style of this or the decoration style of this shipping container house is um, kind of like a modern modern uh, like urban kind of feel there's a lot of black and white and uh, the accent color in the bedroom is yellow I decided to go with yellow because I found a really cool bed pattern on one of the beds and um, just to mention uh, you guys are probably gonna notice that there's a lot of custom content in this uh, shipping container house uh, it took me a lot to um, a lot of time and a lot of uh, effort just to like you know get all the details and when I was looking it over in the end I still saw stuff that I wanted to fix and add more to but I had to like stop myself and you know because I already had the recording done but I in the end I add a couple more things um, and the way this recording is I had to like uh, clip out a lot or not really clip out but uh, pause the recording for a little bit so my my program could take a break because my computer isn't the greatest and so I have to kind of take breaks now and then now and again with my recordings so uh, if it you'll see kind of notice that it'll jump from one one thing to another sometimes that's usually when I stopped recording and uh, yeah this house took about two days or so so I've been working on it for most of today and I started on it yesterday so um yeah, uh, I hope you guys do enjoy it. Uh, I'm thinking of putting these, like all my my like Sims 2 house building videos or Sims 2 houses, I should say, um, on Sims Sims File Share, I think it's called, or uh, the Media Fire, and posting the links. If you guys do want this house, just let me know, and I will do that. Um, if you guys want to download or if you guys like it or have any questions, let me know. Um, I get a lot of my custom content from either Mod The Sims, Mod The Sims 2 or Mod The Sims now they call it. Uh, it has tons of amazing uh, Sims 2 uh, stuff on it. A lot of really cool downloads and mods and hacks and all that kind of stuff on there. And another thing I do a lot is I just type stuff that I'm looking for into Google and sometimes I'll do Google images or sometimes I'll just do, you know, Google search and it brings a bunch of different websites where I just tend to find like just the coolest things and uh, I, that's just how I find a lot of my custom content for all my games actually. And uh, I don't really use a lot of custom content in Sims 4 builds because I know a lot of people who um, do like to download the rooms or the, the builds that I have and they um, they kind of like it's hard when you have custom content in The Sims 4 and it also lags my game a lot in especially in The Sims 3 too. I had to recently delete all my Sims 3 custom content and my game is still laggy so uh, it's just a lag fest of that game. That's why I'm so excited to get a new computer so I can finally get like the games and uh, where I can play them smoothly that it on higher graphics and everything 
but uh, that won't be for a bit because computers are really goddamn expensive and it sucks, but you know, it has to be, you know, worth it, I guess. It's the one thing to invest money in is computer stuff, it's the future, so yeah. But uh, yeah, no, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Um, I'm not sure if I mentioned that I, my game, yeah, I did mention that, but with the clips. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this, and if you have any questions, or if there's anything that you want to see, like for custom, like, um, like custom house builds or whatever, let me know, and uh, I can try to build it and stuff like that, or if there's something you want to see in The Sims 2, maybe I'll do like a little bit of a neighborhood tour of when it gets built up a little bit more. And uh, this is also the, um, the neighborhood that I'll be having my upcoming Sims 2 LP when I finally get that started and everything. Um, if you guys didn't get a chance, make sure to check out uh, my current household video that I recently posted. I'll try to leave a uh, link to it down below or in the, uh, on the screen or at the end of the video. Speaking of which, um, I recently got a new, kind of a new uh, intro and an outro. I'm really excited about it because um, somebody did that for me and I will link uh, his channel down below if you guys are interested in getting an, him to do one. They're not super like super fancy or anything, they're really simple but they're, it, I really enjoy it. I really liked it. It turned out really nice so uh, yeah, check that out or you guys will probably have noticed noticed it at the beginning of this video you guys will notice it at the end as well um so yeah thanks guys i super appreciate everything that i all the feedback i've been getting from everybody and i appreciate everyone who's been um subscribing to me so if you're a new subscriber thank you and if you are a returning subscriber that you know watch watches my videos whenever i upload i definitely appreciate you guys it really means a lot to me so yeah um hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you are in the world don't forget to check out the links in the description below my facebook my twitter and uh, my website as well so yeah thanks guys bye